going to pitch uh, our chat. So, uh, first of all, could you raise your hand if you're using Facebook Messenger, Viber, WhatsApp, Line, or, or any other messaging tool? So, with your family or friends? Yeah, so most of all, you are using uh, those kind of uh, messaging tools. So, uh, day by day, we are not using uh, emails with uh, our friends or families. So, uh, in, the, uh, in the business thing, the same thing will happen. We believe, we, believe, uh, we can make that happen with chatbot. From email to messaging too. So chatbot is a communication platform designed for company and teams. And then we combine uh, task and file management feature on that. Let me show you a screenshot. Uh, on the left hand side, you can see uh, there are a group chat and direct chat. Then you can select one you want to send a message. In the middle, uh, there is a timeline of conversation. You can also send uh, a file uh, as well. On the right hand side, you can see who is group, uh, in this group chat. Uh, and also in the middle, uh, you can assign tasks uh, from there. At the bottom, uh, that is a task you have to be done. And also, you can uh, have a, a video chat. Uh, video conference from the top. But then starts. We now have uh, 200,000 users now, and it's increasing uh, 15,000 users every month. Then it's increasing uh, uh, month by month. So chat work is a premium model, so paid, but, uh, paid conversion ratio is uh, really important. So chat work conversion rate is more than uh, Dropbox and Evernote. Dropbox and, and Evernote uh, conversion rate is uh, 4 to 4.5 percent, but in fact, the uh, chatbot conversion rate is more than triple of them. These are our customers. Uh, the KDDI. KDDI is the second largest telephone company in Japan. Uh, they are using chatbot more than several uh, employees. Zoho is also using chatbot, even though they have uh, their own chat product. The next Kyoto, uh, they try to uh, choose the uh, messaging tool. Finally, they chose a uh, chatbot. Who we are? So, chatbot is a bootstrap company. Uh, we've, it's been uh, profitable for the past 12 years uh, through uh, web marketing and software sales. Last year, we decided to have all of our employees focus on chatbot. So, we uh, changed our company name into the uh, chatbot in Media College. Uh, we have, a, have had a lot of media coverage like uh, TV, newspaper, radio, and also magazine, and including foreign media uh, like CNN, because we have had the uh, best employee satisfaction rating in Japan uh, two years in a row. Then I wrote the three books uh, for management. The all books I published got uh, number one sales in Amazon. What we want. So we uh, here is uh, we uh, we want to make uh, we want to expand chat work as fast as we can. So we we believe we to, to have a partnership with uh, uh, the uh, company which has a lot of customer in the region. We are happy to work with them. So in Japan uh, we have a partnership with KDDI. Southeast Asia. Uh, we have a partnership with Marfax, Singtel related company. Singtel is the largest telecom company in Singapore. US, uh, we launched a uh, US office in Silicon Valley last year. We've been very hard work uh, for US entry. Then, uh, today we just started a uh, uh, Europe entry uh, here in Luxembourg. So I'm looking for the channel distributor or partnership here in Europe. So that's why we are here. Uh, thanks for listening. We are Chatbot. Awesome. So um, why don't you tell, how did you get Zoho to use you? Because I've tried out Zoho <laughs> and I hate their service. <laughs> so I can imagine why they would use it, but how did you get them to stop using their own tool and to use you guys? So I have a friend who works who works with Zoho, and then uh, so uh, we did this chat work, so we try to use it. So they're using their chat product, email. Also they use chat work, so they use in the same time. Finally they use email and chat. Work. 
And so what, what markets are you guys trying to expand into today? You mentioned you opened up a Silicon Valley office. Are you looking to expand into Europe? Are you present in Europe today? Yes, yeah, so, uh, we try to expand uh, uh, North, North America and Southeast Asia, and of course Japan. But uh, we have no idea about Europe, so I try to you know, uh, exhibit here this time. So I'm looking for the opportunity here. Any questions from the audience? No? Perfect. Well, thank you very much. Let's give them a round of applause.